All right, Even if they have we're gonna on. we're gonna start reading this now. All right, so night one, right, phone scared. guy. Hello, hello. Uh, I wanted to record a message for you to help you get settled in on your first night. Um, I actually worked in that office before you. I'm finishing up my last week now, as a matter of fact. So I know it can be a bit overwhelming, but I'm here to let you know there's nothing to worry about. Uh, you'll do fine. So let's get you focused on getting you through your first week, okay? Uh, let's see. First, there's an introductory greeting from the company that I'm supposed to read. Uh, it's kind of a legal thing, you know. Um, welcome to Freddy Fazbear's Pizza, a magical place for kids and grown-ups alike, where fantasy and fun comes to life. Fazbear Entertainment is not responsible for damage to a property or person. Upon discovering the damage or death has occurred, and a missing person report will be filed within 90 days, or as soon as the property and premises have been thoroughly cleaned and bleached, and the carpets have been replaced. Blah, blah, blah. And that might sound bad. I know. But there's really nothing to worry about. Uh, the animatronic characters do get a bit quirky at night. <laughs> but do I blame them? <laughs> <laughs> Shut up! <laughs> anyway. <laughs> Shut up. Anyways. No, if I was forced to sing those same stupid songs for 20 years and I never got a bath, I'd be a little irritable too. So remember, these characters hold a special place in the hearts of children, so we need to show them a little respect, okay? So just be aware, the characters too tend to wander a bit. Uh, they're left in some kind of free roaming mode at night. Uh, something about their servers locking up if they get turned off too long. Uh, they used to be allowed to walk around during the day, too, but then there was the bite of 87. Was that the bite of 87? <laughs> yeah. I know, it, it's amazing how the human body can live with a frontal lobe, you know? Uh, now concerning your safety, the only real risk to you as a night watchman here, if any, is the fact that these characters, uh, if they happen to see you after hours, probably won't recognize you as a person. They'll, they'll most likely see you as a metal endoskeleton without its costume on. Now, since that's against the rules here at Freddy Fazbear's Pizza, they'll probably try to forcefully stuff you inside a Freddy Fazbear suit. Um, now, that wouldn't be all so bad if the suits themselves weren't filled with cross beams, wires, and animatronic devices, especially around the facial area. So, you, you can imagine yourself having your head forcefully pressed inside one of those could cause a little bit of discomfort. And death. Uh, the only parts that would likely see the light of day again would be your eyeballs and teeth that pop out of front of the mask. <laughs> yeah, they tell they don't tell you these things when you sign up. But hey, first day should be a breeze. Uh, I'll chat with you tomorrow. Uh, check those cameras, and remember, close those doors is absolutely only necessary. You gotta go and serve power. All right. Good night. Hello, hello. Hey, wait, wow, day four. I know you could do it. Um, hey, listen, I may not be around to send you a message tomorrow. It's been a rough night here for me. Uh, I'm kind of glad I recorded those messages for you <clears throat> when I did. Uh, do me a favor. Maybe sometime check the back rooms. I'm trying to try to hold out until someone checks. Maybe it won't be so bad. I, uh, I always wondered what was in all those empty heads. You know, oh no. Children. Spoken? Are they high? Wait, shh.